black fitted t-shirt, black fitted jeans, shirt tucked in, you can see the muscles. Afro-Cuban stud. <laughs> So, we, I actually have been asked twice and been tagged to do the wife husband tag. How and where did we meet? Casually, where I saw you once in, this, in, the, in the studio. Mm -hmm. You were getting ready to do your first album, actually, in the midst of finishing your first, recording your first so album at the, the studio. Yeah, the studio. So, the second question is what was your first impression? I guess you of me and me of you, but we're going to have to answer that like. When, we were, when I was already an adult and we were working together. Well, yeah, because the first time I, I yeah. honestly was... We I, didn't have eyes for each other back then. Wow. <laughs> you were very different. To be honest with you, I didn't even pay attention to you. Thank you, you're so sweet. Sorry. <laughs> and... Uh, <laughs> you're such an ass. Well, you had just done, I guess, a video for... We were in the midst of for, doing a video for yeah, Gloria. For, for Gloria. Uh, um, there was a guy that was working at the at the at the studio. He was an accountant there. He show, showed me a picture of you. Hey, you look beautiful. Yeah. Well, my first impression of you was well, you were already John Sakata and famous, and just another day was playing on the radio. Quote, unquote, to remember you, what I was wearing? You were wearing white some white jeans. Negative. I would have never been wearing white jeans. Yeah. I would never in my life walk out of my house in white jeans, fitted like that, like the way I was wearing them. But anyway. Well, you look great though. Where was our first kiss and how was it? Let's see if you remember. A park. A park in... Uh, wow, I'm impressed. Christmas Park? Merry Christmas Park. Merry Christmas Park. Uh, Do you remember where we had come from? That, that, that I did not remember. You invited me to go have cafe before Starbucks is, existed. So we went to like a little Cuban corner coffee shop and had yeah. cortadito and colada. And then we hung out on that little you know, hill at Merry Christmas Park. I do remember that was our first kiss. That was our first kiss. It was... I was, it was very... very touched, the fact that you... that I was able to actually... That I was giving you a chance. Way. I felt fireworks. Well, we were talking about a lot of different things, obviously. I remember what we were talking about. There's no way you remember. Do you remember? Of course not! How did you know I was the one? Eventually, instinct. I realized that you were the one. Not me. So. so, it's not good, all sentimental now. <laughs> okay, what do you love about me? That's the next question. I'll answer this one first. What do I love about you? The fact that you're so patient and calming. No, it's true. Like, you don't react to things as quickly as I do. Like, I think that's why we work. Because, like, you, I ask you something, and it's like you think about it. And sometimes I even, like, repeat <laughs> the question. <laughs> <laughs> sometimes I repeat the question because I think maybe you're not listening to me. <laughs> and it's because you're still, like, Hold on. I need another glass processing. of wine before I keep talking. I know you're not lying. I'm, I'm saying, I just need another glass of wine real quick. But yeah, that's what I like about you. What I love about you. Okay. That, yeah, that you're, there's actually two things. The fact that you're so patient uh -huh. and calm before you react to things, you you think about them really well. You, you, uh -huh. They're thoroughly thought out. Okay. Whether it's the things that you do or the things that you say. Thank you. <laughs> okay, now, so what do you love about me? <laughs> what do I love about you? The opposite of what I just answered. <laughs> <laughs> How do you keep a relationship healthy in life? Sex. <laughs> <laughs> don't, don't undermine your your personal sex life. I'm serious. I'm sorry, but it's true. You're being I real think, honest. I'm very, being very honest. With the uh, cyber world Absolutely. out there. Absolutely. I'm being honest. That's no proof. filter. Our children may watch this and you just finished saying something that's very personal. I, I hope they, they, they hear and they learn and they understand. And they hear things in television that are Oh my far, God, they probably hear far, and see things worse. So that's worse. fine. <laughs> okay, so places we want to travel. Let's see. Give me one place you want to travel that you haven't traveled to. 
gone on my own, but I would love to go to China with you. I think it'd be something that you would enjoy. It'd be a, a tremendous trip in this or anywhere in Asia. Well, I would love to go either to Bali or Fiji or one okay. of those exotic so in Indonesian. That region. Okay, here we go. Here are the newlywed questions. Let's see if after 20 years we get each other's answers right. Okay. What is my favorite show? Grace Anatomy. No. Scandal. Thank you. But it started with Grace Anatomy. It though. did start with Grace Anatomy. Yeah, it, it, Shonda that Rhimes. Was, that's She's why a badass. it's difficult to say. Great writer. Your favorite show. You don't have a favorite show right now. I don't yet. Yeah, it used to be The same. Sopranos. Yeah. What, but what since I, then you haven't found... I, I, don't, I don't, You haven't gotten into so. anything lately. That's my new uh, undertaking to download some shows that I would love to get into. That I first come sex, me, then come TV shows. So we make time for sex Absolutely. first, and then we don't have enough time to watch the TV shows. <laughs> right. What's my favorite color? What's the color I wear the most? Black. Thank you. Your favorite color, I don't think you have a favorite color you've never had. Usually the tones of pink, light purples, pinks. No? Really? If I could eat one thing every day, if I was in a deserted island. Rice? White rice, Cuban style. No, you'd have, you'd eat the fish and the, you know, kind of like Tom Hanks yeah, yeah, yeah. in Castaway, but honestly, I would only eat rice every day because it wouldn't make me fat. And I'd be like a blimp. So, I don't eat rice. No, honey, the look, listen, I, you're, you're exploring a territory that really deals with a fantasy of mine. What's your favorite food? I want to know now because I was going to say like, like you can have a piece of flan every day. Oh no, God, no. It so I got that one wrong. Okay, what is something that I do that you wish I wouldn't? <laughs> It's okay, uh, you can be honest, I'm not gonna get upset. You can say whatever you need to say. Who you are, your, your outspokenness, uh, your bluntness is, 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 is a staple. It's the flip side of the coin, of course, is that yeah, a lot of that too, it comes with the impact of, of the reality of, of the things that you say. That trigger of, of an aggressive A personality. And, um, but... Okay, stop throwing me under the bus. We're moving on to the next question. <laughs> You're saying a little too much. Weird habits of each other. <gasps> no, 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 this one's better. Wait, 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 wait. What is one unique talent that I have? I can't say it. What is the one unique talent that I have? The, one of your unique talents is Oh, I have more than one? Yes, you do. And one of, one of them is your, your the sense of smell. <laughs> what is one unique talent that you have? Well, that like you sing your ass off, because not many people can sing like you. Thank you. So that's definitely a unique talent. I do what I can. Oh my God, let's see. What does John spend hours doing? Cardio! Lots and lots. <laughs> Who was the one to say I love you first and where was it? I don't remember that. I don't remember that. Ah, we both failed that one. What is your most repeated phrase or sentence? <laughs> one, you have a, one of your... Your first CD had a song named after it. And the one that I detest lately, because you said it to me a lot, the last, especially the last few days. I always say, in my humble opinion. First. Yes, in my humble opinion. And, and then I say what I say. There's, there's a couple others that are not as, as likable, especially for my wife. So. But Whenever he says. It is what it is. It is what it is. <laughs> Yeah. And then you like punch it with that, you end it with that punch, and it's so like, what yeah, do I uh, say? I don't know. I, there's nothing, just, you, you, just, you, you don't have any sayings that I just like. We can't, I can't think of anything other than telling my kids to pick up their clothes and pick up their shoes and turn off the lights, which all mothers, all of us mothers out there, 
say and we'll continue to do until our kids move out. Yeah. Um, but mm. other than that, we've answered most of your questions on Ellen because it was a lot. Wife tag or husband tag or boyfriend tag or girlfriend tag, one of your friends next. Ciao. See, ciao, bye. Mm. My gorgeousness. Sure. <laughs> Good luck editing that. <laughs>